Hello, everybody. This is going to be a quick demo on how to deal with um, the move toward method in uh, assignment eight. So after you've uh, accepted your invite and cloned your repo, uh, you'll have this project in Eclipse. Um, inside of the assignment eight package, you'll find the entity class and uh, this uh, test suite to run all the entity and zombie simulator tests. If I run that as a JUnit test, you'll see that I've built a bunch of this already. I've uh, completed up to the point where move toward is failing. Um, and you can see that here, we've so passed the constructor and the radius test and all these other things. And we get to the move toward test and you can see it's sort of trying to tell us something. Anytime you wanna see this in a little bit more detail, you can click on this button here. Uh, it tells you to remove this runtime exception um, and uh, what to do. And if you've renamed them, we'll go through all that in a second. If I double click on this top line of this stack trace, uh, you can see move toward is mostly provided for you. Um, we sort of calculate what the vector is between this other point we're supposed to move towards uh, from our center. Um, it calculates the angle uh, of that vector. Uh, then you just uses uh, cosine and sine to compute how much it needs to move uh, based on this amount that is specified. And then what we would like to do is we're trying to just provide you this method. We would like to just put in these lines here. Um, we can't do that. So we sort of alerted you to it with this exception, which is telling you uh, to, un to get rid of that line and uncomment those lines. Um, and so now if I format this, you can see it's all going. Now, if you named your, your instance variables X and Y for the center, uh, you should be all set and you should run this and it'll work. Um, you can see that Eclipse is uh, underlining this in red and trying to alert you to the fact over here in the problems tab, it's got a two where it's saying, hey, like I don't have these fields. This is because um, just for the purposes of this video, I named these X center and Y center. If you named your X and Y center, uh, center points uh, instance variables to something other than X and Y, you have to change this. If you name them X and Y, it's fine. Um, and so now if I run this again, what you'll see is that we're gonna pass um, a bunch of tests again, um, and we've now passed all the move towards tests, and now we've moved on to move away from. Um, and so you should just continue along. Uh, this has a very simple solution. Uh, you could, I suppose, copy this code and change it. Uh, I'm gonna encourage you very strongly not to do that. Um, figure out how to build move away from in a very simple way uh, out of move toward. And with that, uh, good luck on this assignment. And uh, if you run into trouble, we'll be here to help.